Welcome to Milwaukee Studios. In today's video, I'm actually being showing you guys how to download Shotcut Video Editor. So let's get into that. So basically, what you're gonna first have to do is you're gonna have to open up Chrome. You just have to search it up. You type in Shotcut real quick, and then you're gonna go down and click on the homepage one. It should be Shotcut.org. And once you click on that, you should be able to actually go in and there should be a bar at the top and you press on the download. And then you'd also go down here. So basically, what you're gonna have to do is you have all of these different options. There's a show downloads for whichever operating system you have. So for instance, you can see what is available for like Linux or Mac or Windows or even just all of them and you can just scroll down everything for it. So I'm actually using uh, Microsoft Windows. So I'm gonna do that and basically it will give you about three major different options. So get the installer for it or you can just get a portable zip file that you'll have to unzip or you even have, you can get it from the Microsoft Store. Um, you also have the ability to donate to them. So for instance, if this was gonna be your main editor and you got it for free basically from here, why not actually show your support? So with that said, basically you want to actually click on one of these. So I always go for the GitHub option. So I'm gonna do that. It should actually pop it up down here. And I always tell it to open when done. And basically it's gonna be downloading it for you. And once it's done doing that, so now that you actually have that and you've accepted it to make changes to your computer, should pop up just like this. And now with that said, you should be able to see right here, it shows the license for it. You can even just click here to see even more of it. Um, basically you need to agree to their license. Um, it will then show you exactly where you want to go. So if you want to change it, just press this browse button and it will literally just open up your directory on your computer and you can click anywhere you need. Um, I'm going to just do this for instance. I'm going to go next. It shouldn't pop up remove old program files necessarily, but since I actually do have it, then it's going to ask me, which I want to remove it, install program files, create start menu shortcut. I'm going to want that. Create desktop shortcut icon. Um, remove shortcut settings from registry. I don't need to do that. Um, but basically after that, then you need to press the actual install button. And with that, now it's going to be actually trying to install it. If you guys want to see the exact things that it's doing to try to install it, you can show details of it and you can see every single item and the percentage that it's downloaded versus seeing it up here just like flying by, which is flying by down below, but you can still see a little bit more of it. So now that it's actually completed, I'm gonna press the close option on it. And now as you can see, I have it downloaded and I can literally just click into that and it should open up Shotcut just like normal. So with that said guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys wanna see more of these, we actually do have a playlist over here with all of our Shotcut videos. And then we also have a video over here that YouTube specifically recommends for you. And with that said guys, remember, keep on editing.